Hi friends, welcome back. This is Jarvis from The Guitar Spa to you where we bring you all the great guitar reviews. We don't just play the guitar and let you hear it. We explain the uh, construction, a little bit of construction of the guitar so at least you have an idea of uh, what type of guitars you're going to buy or or you're going to buy it, things like that. So uh, one more owner just sent me this uh, 2011, yes, the latest uh, 2011 model of the uh, 914 Taylor from uh, Taylor Guitars. Uh, this was uh, uh, bought in Singapore just about two weeks ago from uh, uh, the Singapore distributor Cinemax. Cinemax, uh, the Singapore distributor, they, are, they probably uh, doing very well with uh, selling all the, the authorized di the distributor for uh, Singapore selling uh, the uh, Taylor guitars. Uh, so if you're looking for a guitar, look for them, uh, Cinemax. And this is a uh, latest uh, 914. Uh, this is an upgraded version, uh, 2011. Uh, what they did was uh, they uh, they upgraded it from the normal 900 series uh, inlays on the fretboard, on the the body and certain thing. I'm gonna just explain a little bit. Uh, what you have here is you have a uh, 900 series guitar with uh, a GA size with a standard uh, fretboard uh, a length. You have the ebony uh, bridge, ebony fretboard. You have a Sitka top, a very tight master grade Sitka top on this guitar. You have the uh, beautiful tight grain, in fact the nicest uh, Indian rosewood in the series for uh, tailors. They, they normally on the 900 series, they give you a very tight grain um, uh, Indian rosewood that has a lot of very rich color, rich brown, rich red, rich purple. Uh, on, on the guitar because you're paying top dollar for this guitar. You, the binding on this guitar is Indian Rose with, with the red uh, pin, pin uh, what you call it, purfling lines. Uh, the guitar top is uh, Avalon uh, uh, Rosette with a Indian Rosewood, uh, what you call that, laminate around the circle of the sound hole bound. And you have also a beautiful uh, um, Abalone uh, uh, top puffling on the whole guitar, beautiful. If 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 you were to hear, you see this guitar, you will say this guitar is beautiful. But the best part of this guitar, in terms of look, is you have this. They brought back the Cindy inlays. The Cindy inlays is a beautiful inlay. Just have a look. I'm just gonna put it down a little bit. Just have a look at the Cindy inlays. It's on the website. You can have a look, and also a special inlay that's on the the bridge. I've upgraded the uh, original uh, bone uh, saddle uh, and the pins, the ebony pins. This uh, this is a FMI saddle to give you a richer uh, mid-range, uh, nicer travels, uh, more responsive guitar, a louder guitar, a sweeter guitar, as well as the uh, dyed bone pins uh, that the owner requested. And also the head plate on the 900 series, this is different from the old 900 series. The old 900 series is bound ivory. This is bound and also Indian rosewood uh, with the ebony uh, head plate. But also an inlay here, the uh, special flower inlay on this guitar. What's the bracing pattern on the 900 series? The 900 series, uh, uh, this is the new revoiced version. The re revoiced version moves the X brace up by almost one inch. So you have about half one inch from the sound hole and uh, they have a relief cut just here it means they cut the just the sides here thinner than from here all, all over the circle here to give you a more uh, a little bit more depth on the sound of this guitar so when you play this uh this 14914 series you get a little bit more depth a little bit more depth uh and also but it's, it, it they still retain that taylor taylorish tone, the bright, the modern sounding uh, type of tone on this guitar. Uh, you have the uh, ES system that is built, the pickup system that is built on this guitar. You, They use uh, one sensor here, another sensor just here, and a neck, uh, a neck, sen a neck uh, pickup, like a humbucker pickup. Uh, you can, the, the board, you can actually switch off the, uh, the sensor that's on the top. If you, you don't need, you just want the neck uh, pick up. Uh, how does it sound? Like? I could hear a little bit of noise when I amplify it in, in high volumes, uh, but generally it's, uh, it's a quite uh, acceptable pickup. You you hear the, the exact tone of the guitar. Uh, let's play this guitar, and um, bec because it's a Sitka top, it'll take some time to open. 
and you can actually whack this baby it gives you a lot of headroom as well as you can actually because of the size of the guitar you can actually finger pick and it gives you a very sweet balanced tone not too much bass as compared to the Martins or Gibson but a balanced tone but you have sufficient bass on this 914 beautiful <laughs> on this guitar you can hear it's beautiful sounding rich let's just couple on the third fret and play it about Taylor is uh, you get uh, that uh, beautiful playability. Uh, I, I, I played so many guitars, uh, Macpherson, Gibsons, they all set up very low. But one thing I like about, I still like about the Taylor is they, they seem to get the neck angle and the correct uh, pitch where um, playing live, especially live, it's effortless. Uh, of course, you may just uh, say, hey, you're talking nonsense, but uh, this is basically my opinion. I played Taylor's for a long time um, and something I forgot to mention uh, about this uh, 914 is that this uh, 2011 version has a fretboard extension um, Abalon that's on this fretboard extension just around here just have a look at this beautiful piece so <laughs> Fairly new piece, so it will take some time before it opens up. up uh, but as a new piece, just about uh, two, three weeks old, it really sounds wonderful. So I mean, it's like going to be like fine wine. It's going to to improve. So if you're you're in Singapore and you want to buy a, a Taylor guitar, look for the authorized distributor Cinemax in Singapore. Or if you're in the state, just look for the website. There a lot of uh, good uh, dealers around. And um, my next uh, video, I'm going to. If after this video, I'm going to do a comparison between a, a 914-2011 model against a 914-1996 model. It's like 
the old wine versus the new wine. So stay tuned. Uh, if you need to contact me, my name is Jarvis. Uh, my email address is uh, Gita Saddle, G U I T A R S A D D L E at hotmail.com. Uh, you could post some comments just below this YouTube video. And uh, just be kind, you know, just be kind to me, please. Uh, to my next review, I'm going to say uh, live with passion, play guitar, and allow that music to flow into your soul. I'll see you very soon. Bye bye.